Welcome to the Michigan Golfer Show with your host, Bill Shelton. Join us each week as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great game. Phyllis Barone, Michigan Golfer News. We're here at Pinehurst Resort. And you know, golf is a wonderful thing because when you have friends, they last forever, no matter what state they're in. We happen to run into Mr. Shelton, Bill Shelton, who is a member here and actually has a great history with Art McCafferty, right, from Michigan. Well, we do. Uh, Art and I worked together at uh, Eastern Michigan University for many years, and he retired, and then I, I retired shortly thereafter, and one day he said, uh, "How about let's have lunch, and he knew how much I enjoyed golf, and he floated this idea <laughs> That's of, Art. of a, yes, uh, of an internet uh, streaming TV golf show, the first in the world, as a matter of fact, and uh, I we weren't drinking. <laughs> it was it was. A, Are you it, sure, Bill? It was entirely sober. But he came up with this idea that we literally would create these shows about eight minutes in length because I think he had done some research and uh, come up with it with it that people would watch at that time. Now, of course, people watch streaming videos all the time now. Sure. But we did that, and he asked me to host it, uh, and. Uh, Foolishly or happily, I agreed, and we started uh, uh, a multi-year relationship with doing the shows, and then I also did some writing for the for the magazine at that time. So, yeah, Art and I go back a long way, and I want to congratulate him, and I think that being selected to the Michigan Hall of Fame, he certainly deserves it. He's one of the greatest promoters of Michigan golf that I've ever met. Uh, well, you know, Bill, we call him Arthur Dart for a reason, right? You know, art comes up with tremendous ideas. Now, when you get to the execution, <laughs> we kind of scramble for that. But uh, on the other hand, uh, he has some very creative ideas. Yes. Absolutely. We love art. So from there, Bill, then, obviously, where did you do after that? Well, I had uh, been, uh, of course, the president of Eastern Michigan for 11 years, and then I was on the uh, faculty there for a short time, and a friend of mine was the chancellor down at East Carolina over on the eastern side of the state in the coastal plain, and uh, he kept calling me to come down and uh, run a, a, a multi-million dollar uh, campaign for him as, as vice chancellor, and he said, I know you don't want to be a chancellor any, or a president anymore, et cetera, et cetera. But he said, now, and this was in January, and he said, you know, said, uh, it's beautiful out here. I'm going to go out and play golf this afternoon. Well, there was snow all over Detroit, <laughs> Ann Arbor, Ypsilanti. <laughs> so I first said no, but then he called again. So it ended up that I came down to East Carolina University, a very uh, a great university over on the eastern side of the state, and served uh, for two and a half months uh, as the vice chancellor, then he resigned. Oh boy. <laughs> and so I agreed to serve as chancellor for a year there and then served uh, for another year as vice chancellor. So I stayed down uh, in education here in addition for doing consulting for the Association of Governing Boards, working with uh, boards who were seeking new presidents at that time. And then finally I said, I think I've had enough of this. I'll just play golf all the time. Good for you. And here you are at Pinehurst doing exactly that, right? It is. Somewhat serendipitously, way back in the uh, 70s, I came to Pinehurst one time from uh, northeast Ohio. I was up at uh, Kent State University at that time, came down here and played. And I, I made the statement, you know, I'm going to retire uh, in North Carolina at Pinehurst. Now, little did I know that that actually was going to happen, but it did. Uh, okay. And so we moved here full time uh, to Pinehurst approximately uh, seven and a half to eight years ago. Okay, wonderful. Well, Bill, you know, it's such a pleasure to have run into you. And like I said, um, thank you so much for spending some time with us and giving us a little history about you and art. And obviously, Pinehurst is, suits you well, right? Well, it's, it, it's a great place. Uh, we certainly uh, have advantage of the mountains only an hour and a half away in one direction, the ocean away an hour and a half in the other direction. And then you've got here at this, our complex, we have nine golf courses and a rumored tenth that will be announced soon. Uh, and so it's a golf mecca, and yet you do have access to uh, the mountains or to the ocean shores or, or whatever. So it was kind of a nice 
in-between place, uh, and we have loved living here. Well, you know what? You've talked me into it. I think I'm going to start looking for a house, Bill. <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much for being with us today. I'm delighted. Glad to have you folks. Welcome to Pinehurst. Thanks.